What's up everyone, in this video I'll talk about proposal, a marriage proposal, and how it is detrimental for society and men, men's mindset, possibly women's mindset as well, because this thing is not good. So we have proposal, a stating or putting forward something for consideration, something proposed, suggestion, an offer of marriage. Yeah, so you have all these movies, right? Like, I don't know. Where was the first place where you saw someone proposing? For me, it was probably the movies, TV shows, something in the media, you know? television and uh, you gotta understand that everything that's everything that's in these shows everything that you see and consume affects you and your mindset you might not realize it but it does um, get stored in your subconsciousness and then you like your subconsciousness is like a library where you buy all these books and you put them there and your mind is like a person that works with the books and the knowledge in them and what's written in them and if you fill your subconsciousness with junk uh, you your mind is gonna act like someone who read a lot of junk <laughs> yeah so I have this written here honestly proposal on your knee is kind of gay who started this this trend programmed the whole society with a false perception of gender roles just look at the twist in psychology of men they softened and don't value themselves accordingly as they beg for validation from the woman that's not good for the psyche of men in general you validate yourself and go get what you want you don't hope for validation you are damn sure that you are worth it if you are honestly with one uh excuse me honesty with oneself and self-judgment has been stripped away by those who don't have it so I don't know if that makes sense for uh, sense to you, but that's what I was thinking. All right, so apparently it was invented in like uh, 1700s and 1800s or something. But that might be f fake, false info. I think it's it's been uh, like, yeah, they've been doing this, sure. Like uh, respecting women, like, you know, kiss their hand. That's all right, but that's not proposal. This is like new age stuff. I don't know. A lot of things, a lot of information on the internet is uh, compromised. No, uh, can't trust too many things. Yeah, so we have. <clears throat> I've got some pictures for you, so the vi video is more engaging. You know, <laughs> gotta make it clever. Co colorful somehow so you know let's talk about it let's oh shit can i it's kind of like this what the heck what is <laughs> this troll um yeah we have this picture can you see it this man this man's i know it's not in the picture fully but i'll work with what we get so you know, you as a man, like, I don't know, you are putting yourself in a position where you are lesser. It's like an act because you as a man can never be lesser than your woman. That's just not the way. It's just not how things work. Like, nature works. The laws of the nature of the universe or whatever. You can cope 
all you want, but you can never disprove the, uh, the biology and true nature of people, of the way we are. You cannot just twist reality, because sooner or later the truth, the, the laws of nature will just show up. Mm. And uh, this is just not right. This is not right, All right? This is just beta male shit. Like, like. I mean, uh, I cannot watch it. Like, that's just not right. Yeah, it's it's brainwashing, and you gotta realize what it does to your mental. As uh, like, it makes your mindset to uh hope hope for her to say yes to uh you know your hope for a validation from her but what does it do to your self uh confidence self confidence self consciousness you just when when you hope in something you give up control that you have over the thing so you're no longer in control of the outcome. I think it was like the first step. And then you give control to women. But they don't know what they want. <laughs> we all know women don't know what they want. <laughs> Let's be real here. So then the system creates all kind of programs like feminism and equal equity equality like like the uh, you know give them more control and respect even if they don't know what they want and they just are not capable to do the things that men the the work that's designed for men to do and just twisted everything you know when a woman is better than the man she won't ever be with him long term that's just how it is the man has always always has to be better otherwise she will choose another man you know you see it in nature where, where the animals fight for for the female and she chooses the one that's stronger that wins the fight in society it works the same it's just how it is you know she sees a better man you can say goodbye to her because you know she chooses him so that's the thing we as men have to work on on ourselves to bo to be good enough for her to you know stick with us for her to see the the value of the relationship and uh by this act you show like you show that you how like you show weakness you show that you don't know what you're doing in life and that's just like the stepping stone of trouble in my opinion in some cultures you don't you don't have this thing it's western you know you, you have it written here i think a marriage proposal is a custom or ri ritual common in western cultures you see this in uh, other cultures, you don't have this. And who rules the Western world? Um, it's not good people. They don't have the best interest in their minds. Best interest for you. So, 
that's my take you can do whatever you want with it i just wanted to share it hopefully it helps someone understand or like give someone inspiration to dig deeper you know psychology is a thing that can go very deep and many people just don't take it seriously or don't cannot comprehend it the complexity of psychology because it's not something that a human can see it's something a human has to sense a different way or like non materialistic way you know you can see body language and stuff uh, tonality but that's another topic just I'm just saying uh, the commitment to a relationship should be initiated by women as, as I said two males fighting women chooses that's it not this gay shit I mean you know what are you a bitch are you a bitch so like you don't she she's supposed to be our bitch so so that's how it is you can argue but uh, i know i'm right and it's not even that uh extreme misogyny it's just reality the biology laws of nature it applies so that's it i'm just rambling by now and i hope you enjoyed this video all right please subscribe peace